morning or actually it's the afternoon now welcome back to my hunting channel 2021 part six today i'm sitting in my stand why it's nice it's 43 degrees outside it's pretty nice inside this thing i had snow up on my roof yesterday so it's finally melted off and i got the ice off of here today too but here's the good part i'm sitting in my new tideweed chair uh, i've got them both in stand one and stand two now now listen to this it goes 360 degrees and it's quiet. My uh, game winner bench seat that I had, very uncomfortable uh, for the most part. It also squeaked every time I went this way. So I kind of worried about, you know, because deer's ears, they're the same as ours, but they got them big mittens that they can hone in on you. So that's kind of a kind of an advantage for them there. Uh, the Tideweed chairs, people have been in contact with me. Yes, I'm, they are made in China. But I'm going to tell you what, they're a good quality chair. They're very comfortable. If I have to sit here for a few hours, let me tell you what, I'd rather sit in this chair because it is nice. Uh, I'm happy with it. Plus, I got a whoopee cushion to take me up a little higher and make it a little warmer on the butt. I plan to get, uh, my son-in-law showed me this thing called uh, the Mr. Buddy Heaters. We'll put one here in the corner to stay warm as well. Uh, I hate the cold, but that's only going to be like November, December time frame if I need it. Uh, uh, my hunting area, man, I'm, I'm very happy with it. Uh, I got a lot more visibility for deer coming. My food plot is starting to turn green from August of last year and more looks like it's starting to take hold now because we just had a couple days worth of rain. So that's a good thing. I'm supposed to have more rain tomorrow and Sunday. So all that rain will help push my seeds into the ground and we're going to hope for a better season. Feeder, they're working great. And uh, stand one, let me tell you what, that, that food plot, and the deer corn have been up there over a week now. And uh, let me tell you what, I've had 12 to 15 deer, three good bucks, uh, one really super 10 point buck that came in. I've not seen him before. And then I got a little spike buck. I call him one spike because he's only got one spike in the side of his head uh, sticking out right now. And then maybe 60 or more turkey, all in the same area at the same time. That's what surprised us. We're not used to that. We used to see one or the other, but now we've seen them both. Uh, it, 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 it's, this is going to be a rewarding year. I know everybody's got this COVID stuff out here, but hey, I got social distancing. I'm out here by myself. So that's good. So let's talk about another channel, MeWe.com. It's kind of like a better than Facebook because it's not censored as much. There's three good groups on there, Tennessee Deer Hunters, Crossbow Hunters, and Food Plot and Management uh, section. Those three right there by themselves are a wealth of information. There's some inexperienced people there like myself. There's some experienced people that have been hunting years like that. Uh, all my life, I was dedicated to the military and traveling. I didn't have this opportunity to do what I'm doing now, or at least I didn't take an interest because you're tired after all the other stuff. So check out MeWe.com. Like I said, this is part six. Uh, it'll probably be the last video for uh, the until the season picks up in September, I might do one more. I don't know. We'll see how long this one goes. But what we're going to do next is review the 10 point Wicked Ridge three, Rampage 360, my bow and my wife's crossbows. And then I want to talk to you about the BOG, B O G, big letters, Death Grip. I have, like I said, four. Uh, I ordered four. I got one for me, my son, my son in law, and one for my wife excellent thing you put the bow on there and you're just gonna move this thing over here and okay i got it up and down i don't have to hold it i can hold it steady so we're gonna do a review on that as well at the same time kill two birds with one stone 10 point reached out to me the other day called me said hey my crank system's on the way fedex tracked it it'll be here monday so hopefully next week sometime we'll be able to break out the cameras and that oh got my palm two in so hopefully i can retire the uh good old cell phone here and start using my uh new camera it's supposed to be nifty you know move it around more steadier than what i got right here so anyway i want to thank you for looking at this thing but before i do that i want to show you the chairs okay all right this is my tideweed chair let me show you the name right there bigger than nothing it's got four legs they're adjustable i did a review on these already in the house but i wanted to show you it's in the deer stand and one more view of my hunting area that tree right there i gotta trim the branches down i gotta go slower i know stick it out my water trough let me come to the other side and pick it up over here and look at that the food plot runs right down the middle and over to the side and over to the side same with over here so we do have a good food plot going 
So I want to thank you for watching my channel.